I am the CEO of Renegade. Hey guys, what is up? It's your boy Emmanuel King. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are in the Dirty Ass Kitchen. Why you must ask? Because it's National Pancake Day. With it being National Pancake Day, you know I have to make pancakes. Like they're one of my favorite foods ever. It just so happened that my sister got us some Aunt Jemima pancake batter. And with the Aunt Jemima syrup, yes I know it's halfway empty, don't judge me. We it was just like my habit that I have to make pancakes on National Pancake. National Pancake Day is almost over. The time is 9:51. So I know how to make the girl go crazy when you treat her like you're number one, baby. Where the fuck is the fucking plants? Oh my god. Hey guys, so quick little update. I found a pan, but it's dirty, so now I'm cleaning it. Because, you know, I'm wifey, I'm hubby material, literally. I can do it all. Ladies, hit me up, my DMs are open. You can barely see my head in the frame. Okay, so we cleaned the... And now, it's time to get my ingredients. I mean, you, most of you guys already know how to make pancakes, but I'm just going to say it anyways to make the video like 20 t minutes longer, you know? So the ingredients you use to make pancakes is butter, pancake mix, well this isn't even butter, this is margarine. And the way that we're doing it today is Chinese style. What the fuck is that? I don't know if I should like walk you guys through this or just fucking make my pancakes and like talk. Um, we'll see. We will see. Update. I don't know where our measuring cups is, so I'm just going to use my Spider-Man cup because we're not going to eat that much anyways. You know what's like so freak- ah! You know what's like so funny, in a way? I can't find jack shit in like my actual house, like this place where I live, but like when I go over to Cass's house or even like- oh god, I'm just making a fucking mess. Or even when I go over to, like, Dylan's, I know where shit is. Like, I'm- that just proves that I'm at other people's house more than I should- more than I am. Uh, what the uh, fuck is that? Ah! Uh, Y'all, there's like a whole line. Should I just, like- Gives zero shit, but like this is fucking bubbling, and it's so uh, I don't know. I hate when like things bubble. If that makes sense, I'm gonna just shut up and make the pan fucking pancakes. soupy but I don't want it to be like thick uh, I can literally prevent
predict this video. It's just gonna be me like being frustrated and making pancakes because they're not gonna be the way that I want them to be. Then they're gonna come out fucking sloppy and then like I'm just gonna fucking eat them because you know. Oh god though. I'm about to go fucking Trisha Paytas on this fucking pancake. It's over. I Pancakes are probably one of my most favorite foods. So like, when it comes to those bitches, it's over. Denny's, IHOP, Hash House of Go-Go, Hash House of Go-Go. Period. Man, I really wish I had a relationship so I could spank a girl with this bitch. I'm probably only gonna make like three pancakes because one, I'm tired. Two, I don't know, I'm not fucking hungry. Like that hungry. And three, I know my sister's gonna want to make some pancakes or half pancakes, so I'm just gonna leave a stack for her. Oh! Hey! I, but I did that though. I did that. Like, Gordon Ramsay got nothing on me. I don't, I ain't want no smoke, but like, I did that. This pancake's gonna be 10 out of 10. I'm, I'm gonna drop out of clown school to go to culinary. Cause I'm that bitch. Kiki! Y'all, I need new Netflix shows and or music. I don't know. My music taste is pretty different from other people. I mean, to like indie pop, like all that hippie shit. But my DMs are open for new Netflix shows and music. I have lately been listen, been listening, been watching. What's it called? It's one of those superheroes. I know, shocker. Um, their name's Daredevil, or, yeah, it's Daredevil. His show's kind of cold, not gonna lie, but the thing about it is that, like, it only has three seasons, and I'm looking for a TV show with, like, ten to twelve seasons. Look, number two, we got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. Oh. Hey! I just single-handedly ended Gordon Ramsay's career. Hell's Kitchen, more like E-Man's Kitchen. And that's on period level. Thick meter. Y'all see that steam though? Ooh, she a thicky. Okay guys, I think this is going to be the last pancake. I maybe should add some more water. This is going to be the last pancake of the night, and then we're going to eat them. Well, I'm going to eat them. And then, I'll tell you guys a review on it. Ah! Oh no! Oh no! So much has gone wrong so quick! This one's not gonna be thick. This one's not gonna be like its sisters. This one's not gonna be like the other big girls. This one's gonna be a flatty patty. It, literally a flatty patty. Oh, sis, I tried. I really did. I'm like, no cap, I really tried on you. I'm just fucking everything up. 
I turn around and I catch Sis throwing it back like, oh honey, what are you doing? Kiki. She giving it the doggy downward. What? I forgot to mention that I took an edible before this, and now I like sort of feel it kicking in. Which is also good because, you know, I'm about to eat pancakes and we're about to get lit. Before, before we eat them, here's the final. Literally like two days ago, I was talking to Dano about how her diet is going. If you don't know who Dano is, Dano's the love of my life. I love that bitch. She can literally suck my dick any day and I wouldn't have a problem with her doing so. But I was talking about how like her diet's going because she's doing really good with her diet. And told me she only eats avocado toast and chicken which you know I can't do because I'm vegetarian so like I just complimented on her and I was like a bit thinking about like going on a diet but the thing about that is I'm such a fat ass bitch like I love chocolate, I love pancakes, I literally, I could not be hungry and I'm gonna be fucking hungry. Dylan, Daphne and I are going to Golden Corral tomorrow, like bitch I'm always eating. And if I'm not eating, I'm smoking. So like, not gonna lie, it balances out, but the thing is that like, I just, there's no point. With that being said, I've also, like, contemplated going to the gym, but, like, I've done that way too many times, of getting a gym membership and then just not fucking going because I'm a lazy piece of shit. Like, once I'm at the gym, I'm like, oh, I could do this every fucking week, but at the same time, like... My back already hurts from having all this love and support for bitches that don't give the same energy back. Like, that's basically the gym 25-8 for me. And you want me to go to an actual gym? Can't do it. I'm just gonna shut up for a minute and let you guys enjoy me having a pancake montage. I just realized that I'm wearing Xavier's shirt, which made me like jump into my another point that my closet literally does not have my clothes in it. Like it's all filled with Cass's clothes, Dano's clothes, Xavier's clothes. I don't, and then all of my stuff, I literally don't know where it went. It's probably at Cass's house. It's probably like in the fucking abyss. Like I have not seen my um, my cheer hoodie. It's not my cheer hoodie, but it's like my brother's cheer hoodie. So what's his is mine. I haven't seen that bitch since what November. I'm like the last. Ah. I don't know. I had some black dress pants that I was going to wear. 
and I realize that they're at Cass's house and I can't go to Cass's house tomorrow because Cass, Dano, and Alex won't be there. Fuck you, bitches. So, now I gotta wear something fucking ugly to Golden Corral. But, love that for me. What the fuck is this fucking dog doing? Stop looking at me like that, dude. Dude, stop looking at me like that, dude. <laughs> I'm finished with my pancakes, which means I'm finished with this video. Um... For watching this video please give it a big thumbs up if you liked it um comment down below your favorite part you know i love reading the comments you guys make me laugh and i'll see you guys next week peace Time to cut them off, I need help I know how to make the girl go crazy When you treat her like you're number one, baby